Hey, what is up, guys? It's Guild Spire here, and welcome to. <clears throat> excuse me. Welcome to an impromptu stream of Elden Ring. For those of you in the Discord, you knew full well that I took a day off of work and feel a bit better after the move. Uh, honestly, I just laid in bed for the majority of the day and decided, you know what I want to do? I want to play some freaking Elden Ring. So here we are. We're going to probably be on for like a couple of hours. Uh, and we're going to actually be going to Stormville Castle. Look at this. Look at this. We finally beat... Why are there two... There are two sites of grace way too close to each other. It makes me mildly concerned. Makes me mildly concerned. Alright. I think we already leveled up, to my knowledge. Do we have any... Things... We need to think about. I don't think so. Yeah, I think we're pretty much good. Remember that we now do have access to sorcery, which is pretty awesome. I do like that. C come over here, won't you? What? Hello? Who are you? You, you're, you're tarnished, aren't you? Yes, I am. I would advise against taking the main gate into the castle. And why is that? It's tightly guarded by hardened old hands. Oh, t -t try the opening right here. Right where? Don't that one? It. You'll breach the castle undetected. I do like stealth! Yeah. Okay. The spirit. But now, here's my question. Why are you telling me this? The kind of tarnish that I like. I pray for your success. Why Why is he telling me this? That's my biggest question. Use that opening to breach the castle. The guards haven't a clue about it. <laughs> You'll slip right inside undetected. Huh. Yes, you're cheap. Okay. So that that seems the repeat. What are people saying here? Rat ahead. Dastard ahead. Yeah, see, I tried jumping. <laughs> you know what? I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Left. Praise the item. Praise the item. Gold rune. There's something down here. What is this? Hold up. Let's let's activate this, but I'm curious on something. So there's this opening here, of course. Rune fragment. But I'm curious on something. There there's clearly a pathway down here. What's this all about? We I mean, actually I mean it seems like we can go down here. Let's see. I'm curious now. What is this all about? Very curious. Another item. A hole in the wall. Not seeing any blood, so... Looks like we need to summon Torrent for this. We can't. Interesting. So if we do this, this is a stupid idea, but this might work. No. Oh, I did see the pop up. Unless it was the red message that I saw. Yo, what's up, Liz? What's up, giraffe? Uh, okay, looks like we can't pillage remains midair. So if we go around here, castle butthole. I mean, there. Th you know what? Oh, is this the main? Okay, this is the main entrance. I see now. I see. Okay, so that's the main entrance. Imagine there are enemies there. But I do want that item. I don't know what it is, but I do want it. Um, okay. Let's try... Well, actually, I guess we've already made up our mind, haven't we? Because... 
we came down here, we could go back to the side of Grace. There is that option. What's about this? Try jumping. Shut the hell up. Stop. No way in hell. Though I wonder. Oh, no way. Oh, no way. We hit that corner, then what? That's the question of the day. There's no way we can... No, there's no way we could get over there from here. There's no way in hell. Not even going to attempt. Try jumping. Once again, shut up. At least the other one I could, like, maybe see an excuse for. You, you just shut up. You just shut up, friend. Well, this is very much the main entrance. I don't... Wait, oh, that's where we already are, aren't, wasn't it? Yeah, we already beat Margaret here. So hold up one second. How do we get to that other side of that hole? Huh. The other side of the hole. Right? We see this drop off here. And then that there. So how do we get there then? For the item? That's what I want to know is the item. There's something down here. No. Ooh, wait. Yes, there is. Hold up, hold up, hold up. What this? What this? What is up over here? Furl Calling Finger Remedy. And then there's this wooden staircase. Okay. This is to get that item that I saw. It is. There's blood here. Why? Ooh. How did you die, friend? Fire grease. Okay. It's nothing, like, too extravagant, but might mean we might have use for that later. If a enemy you're playing against is, or faced up against is weak to fire. Very strange. Okay, though. I do love those little things where it makes you think of, how do I get that? Like, by what means do I get that? It's the main entrance. So there are people there. There's no way for me to open this in the first place. It's not like I have much of a choice but to go to the way, go the way that this guy said. All right. Time for treasure jumping off. I'm going to say no to that one, friend. Going to say no to that one. Good luck. Oh, God. That's always a good sign. I hear something. It's like another blacksmith. Those are nests. What the hell? What are those? It's either like the wall was hit by like a cannon or those are almost like nests. Remember that there is a thing or person called the spider. Smithing stone. Do you worry of bird? Bird. Hi, bird. The sight of grace. Anything else up here? Doesn't look like it. Interesting. Hopefully that bird doesn't attack. That'd be rude. What's over here? More bird. Nothing over there. And over... I'm trying to think. Down here. Have we been down here? No, it's on the other side. Doesn't look like anything's there, right? So I don't know if there's a reason for us to go down, necessarily. But I am curious to why that's even an option. What? Does that bird have... Excuse me? Does that bird have freaking... Swords for Schweet? 
I was trying to say feet and shoes, and I got feet. What the hell? Okay, yeah, I, I you know what? I guess be wary of birds. They are government drones, apparently. Who would have thunk? That's why I always have my shield out. For a bad idea. Hmm, doesn't look like we can get up here. Yeah. Some bolts. That's actually not bad for us to have on hand. Though I guess I did get rid of my bolts for my staff. So keep that in mind, I guess. And remember that that does mean we have ranged abilities now. And she does make me question if I want this here instead. So I can have my shield up. Because we see you over there. Did not reach? God dang it. They didn't reach. Oh, you gotta be joking me. I feel like if I can lock onto you, I should be able to reach you this freaking thing. Oh, you that deals a lot of damage, actually. Come on, attack me. You won't. Cool. Flight pigeon. Oh, they're both coming. They're both coming now. Maybe not. Oh, at least one is. Oh, that went straight through my shield. That one's down. Let's drink up our flask of crimson tears. No reason to use the other one just yet. Oh, that's bad. That missed. Are those shackles on the bird? What the hell? I need to be careful. This bird's going to kill me. Alright, once we get one hit in, it's a lot more manageable, but holy hell, those birds are dangerous. Some more smithing stone. You'd actually look into what the smithing stone is for. I imagine it's for, like, upgrading weapons. Would make sense. Kind of like titanite shards. Another bird. Can I reach it from here? No, of course not. Of course not. Ambush ahead. Ambush ahead. Don't see an ambush. Let's go to the site of grace and touch it real quick. That way, even if there is an ambush, we can always come back here. I mean, I see the bird there. I feel like we've already gone everywhere we need to in this area. I feel like we don't need to worry about the bird. Try jumping. Behold tower, but if only I had a map. Behold tower. Have we been to that tower? I don't think we... Actually, no, we can probably get to that tower. But I'm not sure if we actually ever can. Actually, where is that on the map? Like, it seems like it should be there, but not entirely certain unless it's this area over here that we're seeing. Which it might be. Yeah, there's the bridge right here. Try fingers. Oh, many, many. So yeah, I guess it's over. Interesting. The map makes it look like it's a much shorter distance than it is. But yeah, that's that area over here, which we've been to, haven't we? Yeah, we've been to here. Church of. Where is that area? I'm trying to remember. I feel like we have been there. Uh, do we have any reason to upgrade or level up further right now other than hoarding runes? Probably not. No great way to sneak up on... Oh, no, actually we can. He has a patrol path. We can sneak up on this guy. 
Question is, do you see me from there? Answer is yes. Answer is very much yes. Uh, okay, we need to go further down onto some more even ground. Where we really want to start fighting here. Was that an air slash? That's an art of war. Ooh, okie dokie. I was trying to avoid that. Did not work out well, as we can tell. There's another one. Anyone in here? I think we can get behind this guy. There we go. Oh! There's a guy up there who saw us, though. All right, let's use our Glintstone Staff. Hope it reaches. It does, excellent. One more. There we go. Yeah, actually, you know what I'm realizing? I think it's the prisoner that, like, starts off with some sorceries. Not gonna lie, kind of thinking that the prisoner may have been a good choice. Because you get that ranged ability. Are you friends or foes? Be wary of weak foe. So these guys... Oh, okay. What was that? A rock? Did you just throw a rock at me? They're throwing rocks at me! Freaking rude. Let's dispatch a view. Is there anything down here? Uh. There's a light, but I don't know if that is just like the light from the top or not. You did see something back here though. Oh, it's a. Because be an item, but why is it always message? God dang it. Of course that would be a message, not an item. Like, oh yeah, I see it's an item. That's a freaking message. Huh. I hear someone. Big stompy feet. Come back around. Oh, no, they're coming back around. Oh no, they stop right there at the item. Okay, we might be able to make this work for a backstab. You have a big axe. I'm not a fan of that. Okay, let's let him go around at the item. And we can sneak up on the patrol. Get a nice little backstab in. Why are those barrels red? Those might contain gunpowder. Crescent moon axe. Ooh. -hoo -hoo. Let's take a look at you. A bit weaker in comparison. It's a DD scaling. Crit of 100 versus 110. Not much different. No, that's Battle Axe. Hold on. Crescent Moon Axe. 146 DD, but a strength of 25 needed. Why not? Let's go for that. Hook Claws. Ooh. Hook Claws. Let's take a look at you. This has probably has bleed. Um, physical is pretty minor. Causes bleed upon buildup. Let's try it out. Why not? Let's try it out. I feel like this would be a good, uh, power stance weapon. This would definitely be a good, good power stance weapon. Do you see the new Gen 9 Pokemon? I did. Worried about an ambush here. Whenever there's, like, an open stairway like this with open areas above, I'm always worried about ambush. Explosion ahead. Oh, I'm right. These are gunpowder barrels. Yep, look at this. Ooh. <laughs> weed cat? Yeah, I see that. All right. Let's see here. Let's go for you first. Can I reach you with my pebble? Yes, I can. Let's 
Yeah, I'm so glad we did this. I'm so glad we went into at least get the, the pebble. That's such a good, versatile way of dispatching enemies from afar. All right, any other enemies? So far, no. There's an item back there. Interesting. I, ooh, there's a lot of items. Huh. Throwing daggers. Okay. Death down there. Do not try jumping. What's in here? This looks like a prison cell. It's locked. So we need we need a key of some form. Alright, another enemy there. Looks like with another set of explosive barrels, too. Smoldering butterfly. Wait for that to go off. I'll see. We could probably just go in without any fear and take him down. Yeah, we are doing a we're doing a bit of an early stream, but don't worry. We'll still do the regular stream as well. I just wanted to play Elden Ring. I'll be honest. I just want to play this game and I I have made it so that I will not play this offline. Are you asleep? This man asleep? This man looks to be asleep. Don't you worry, buddy. We'll put you to sleep soon. All right, let's jump down here for the item. Some golden runes. Those actually have a lot more runes than I expected them. All right. But yeah, I, I took the day off today. Frank and I spent like the entire weekend moving and I did all the physical labor, and I just decided, you know what, I need a day to rest, so I spent, like, the majority of the day in bed. And then from there, here we are now. How's moving? <sighs> Exhausting. Spiderweb. Anything of significance here? No. It, it was very exhausting, to say the least. It's just that, like, when we first moved, there wasn't as much stuff to move as there was this time. This is technically our second time moving. The streamer who, whenever you play DVD, you would stream it and say you never play DVD without streaming it. Oh, what? Pokemon? Whenever you play DVD, he would stream it. Oh. Uh, whenever he never played DVD without, what, Elden Ring or Pokemon? Ooh, okay. Dark room, big guy on left. Cutscene? <laughs> oh, did the rat just trap us in here? Oh, what the hell? That's an art of war. Oh my word, this man is going to be something fierce. This is gonna be something I can feel it. Physic. Let's backstab you. There's bleed. That bleed actually did a pretty decent amount of damage. There's the Art of War. Whoa, that gap closer's nasty. You spent a day on DVD without streaming it on Twitch. Oh, I see, I see, I see what you're saying. I got a bit confused there. I need just one more hit. Okay, two more hits. Okay, I need to not get hit. I'm gonna corner though. Need to be careful here. Oh god. Ooh! I tried to go in for the hit first, did not get it. But I see what you're saying, I see what you're saying. Okay, Jesus Christ. Of course, like one hit away on this guy. I did not expect that gap closer to be that aggressive. I have to go all the way back up here, for God's sake. Um, we definitely want to... I was gonna say, take him at range, did not work. Oh, they're all three here now? The hell. Yeah, the bleed came way too late on them. I feel like maybe the bleed's good on bigger foes, 
But like the smaller ones, like it comes towards the end already. I do really like the, the overall feel of this weapon though. I feel like it'd definitely be a really good power stance weapon. There we go, there's the bleed build up. Here come the firebombs. You can probably get through this pretty quickly, I would think. We need to go past you, because if we don't, there are those. Let's backstab you, friendo. Alright. Good there. Uh, yes, the crafting runes are upgrade and whatnot. Gotcha. I figured as much. It, it seemed pretty straightforward on that, like Titanite shards, right? Alright, we can backstab you. And then time for the big fight again. We can probably drink our Flask of Wondrous Physic first and have that strength buff at the very beginning. It doesn't do the cutscene this time, so we can actually get a free backstab. And a runes. Excellent. Alright, sounds good, Steamed. Thank you for being here as always, friend. Yeah, no poise break whatsoever. Oh, there's the freaking Art of War. Let's drink our flask real quick. Doesn't hurt to do so. Here's the gl uh, gap closer. Really delayed strike. We get the backstab for free here and a free crimson flask. And the bleed. Oh, no, it's not done yet. Oh, my word. I thought it was. And I guess it was just a uh, delayed. Banished Knight Greatsword. Banished Knight Greaves. Ooh. I do like the sound of that. Are there mimics in this game? I don't know if they're mimics. Curved Sword Talisman. Another talisman. Intriguing. Rusted key. Uh, let's take a look at the Great Sword. Already better than our other Great Sword. A DD scaling as well. And we have the strength to use it. So let's do that. Yeah, I'm down for this. I do like the bleed weapon, though. I think that could be kind of cool to use against uh, human enemies for the most part. Um, so. So, 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 so. Wait. Oh. I think it's just the guy we killed. We never picked up whatever item he had. Um, is there only one rusted door? Or, yeah, uh, only one door we have to open? This one? Right? Don't think there's one on the other side. No. There's just this one. So far, so good. All right, making progress. Making progress here. This feels very, like, Dark Souls-esque. This is a legacy dungeon. I really like this. It's so cool how we can go from an open world to, you know, basically what most other Dark Souls games provide. Ooh, there's an item there. How do I get there? Ooh! Didn't realize there was a gap. I forgot I tried to do Dark Souls jumping, and I did not need to do Dark Souls jumping. That was big ol' whoopsie right there. I was trying to do uh, B into B, but instead we have A. I kind of wish you could do both. I kind of would like that, actually. If you could do both B into B and B into... Or it, a rant uh, otherwise, I think that would be maybe not a bad idea from a design perspective. Because that way you could do running and don't have to press another button. It would just be B into B. Could be kind of a cool idea. I wonder if I can map that out. All right, we're going this way, aren't we? Where'd this guy go? Did he fall? Interesting. This does a whole, like, in the grand scheme of things, feels like less damage. Unless that guy was just stronger in some capacity. Fire grease. 
Oh yeah, he did fall down. Look at that. Look at this man. Now there is an item there. How do I get there? Huh. Stop throwing rocks at me. Rude. What happens if I do this? Yeah, falling. That's what happens. Let's backstab you real quick, friendo. Oh, I don't have the strength for this weapon, actually. I thought I did. I guess I might be able to only two-hand it. Uh, don't know how to replace the line on the weed whacker. That's a big oof. All right, we got some garb, commoners garbs. These are commoners we're attacking. They seem, like some seem sentient enough to not want to fight, right? While well, some not so much. Yeah, we can only two hand this sword. Makes me kind of feel like going back to the claws. I mean, these are all human enemies. So, they are susceptible to bleed. So, let's do that for now. Can I just casually jump? I can casually jump. About up here. Looks like there's a ledge out there. How do we get to that ledge? Looks like over here. Okay, there's a guy there. I don't know if we can make that jump. Yeah, there's not much we can do here but face this guy head on. There's a, like another way there. He was built on the claws but died a lot because of how short range they are. Yeah. Ooh, shield bash. I'm oh, not the guard counter him, I feel. No, I need to, that's right, for shields, uh, ooh, wow, that is shorter range than I expected. All right, there's the bleed out. Next friend's here. Hi, friend. Oh, don't want to do it. I want to lock on. He's, like, at the corner where I can't lock on. Like, it's really, oh, we just got caught in the freaking doorway. Oh god. Like, it's really nice because it's a very quick slash and dash. So I could definitely get used to the claws. I feel like I would need to power stance them though if I'm going to use the claws in this way. Is the only thing. I definitely feel like these need uh, a power stance. So dual wielding claws. I used to actually run that build in DS2. Um, dual wielding claws with... Uh, the claws in DS2 actually benefited, were one of the only weapons in the game that benefited for having both bleed and poison. Uh, for some reason, the poison actually increased its overall damage, not just the bleed, which normally when you apply bleed on weapons like that, it actually decreases the damage. So it's kind of cool in that regard. I want to get that item, but I think I have to go that way to do so. Let's see. You need to remember there's also a different way. Anything over here? No, just kind of a way back, it looks like. There's guys here. These guys aren't attached to the area I've been to, are they? Where does that go? Oh, back into there, I see. So we jump in there, we can gain access to there, but where does that gain us access to? What's the benefit of going here? Interesting. I'll have to look into that. Oh, here's an item. Armament to head? Black hammer. Interesting. So if we... I see. So if we can get into that hole, we can get there. I don't think there's a way to get there otherwise. I mean, other than falling. Try jumping. Can we survive that if we do? That's what I don't know. Because I want to take a look at this hammer. Brick hammer. Physical 122. Uh, it's a flat-up strength build weapon, so that might not be bad. 
You can always, if we want to go strength, we could do that. I feel like jumping might be a bit ambitious. Whereas if we aim for this instead, we can try jumping onto the beam. There we go. Backstab you off the edge. And then... Here's this friend. Come on, hit me again! Let's counter hit him. That should be enough bleed. And we're just gonna wait for this guy to come up the ladder as well. Meet the person who calls you maidenless? Not yet, no. We, I feel like you've missed a lot recently. Or in some capacity. Because, like, I don't even have the ability to summon ash, spirit ashes yet. Oh, did you... What? Well, that's a thing you can do. I mean, it makes sense. Throw freaking Molotov at the... Come back here. Come back here. There we go. Any text message from Frankie? All right, let's go down. So what is here? What is here? Why is it always whole? Oh, I'm sure we could probably like have a counter. So what's the point of going here? That's what I don't know. Doesn't seem like there's any reason to be here. Maybe the only reason was for if you decided to try and make the jump there. That's my only thought why this area is here in the first place. So you didn't just outright die. Maybe. Other than that, I don't know. Other than that, I do not know. Uh, let's see. Wasn't there an enemy that we didn't kill? Or did we kill him on the way down? I forget now. I fear footsteps, so I don't know, to be certain. Hmm. Yeah, I still want to get that item, but I don't know how other than potentially jumping from over here over there, but I don't think my jumps are that far. Uh, it's hard to say, but maybe. Like, we definitely have hops. Like, I still think that jump's a stretch. So, I don't know. I, I don't think that's a reasonable jump to take. I'm gonna have to look at alternative routes. Or alternate routes. Uh, with that being said, let's head over this way. Ooh, Tababa! You suck. Holy hell. Like, I had my shield up and everything. I just did not expect that whatsoever. Oh, my word. Give me a freaking heart attack, you did. Dead, you dead. Anything over here? No. Uh, let's see. Nothing there. It's over here. Looking like a whole lot of nothing there as well. Behold, sleep. Oh, you know what that is? You know what that area is? That's the meat. That's the initial area, isn't it? We get out into that little area right there, that little courtyard, and I think that's where the first boss is. I think that is right. I think that's right. Blood here. Why? 
Whenever there's blood, you have to ask the question of why is there blood. Mushroom. Any benefit to jumping here? It doesn't look like it. No. Unless. No. Well, I think I can think of... No, I don't think there's really any benefit to jumping there. I don't think there's any benefit at all. Alright, let's stealth up. Anything to our left? Doesn't look like it. I hear something to my right. As always, we want to explore. See if there's anything over here. Doesn't seem like it. And that's just the whole back into the area we've already been. What's that sound? I love watching other shades also like stealthing around. Oh, this big dude. Is there multiple or just one? Looks like just one right now. Let's take a look at his pathing. Backstab him. Another Art of War. And it hits hard. Oh, what the hell? You okay there, friend? Backstab you again. You should bleed on the third. Can I get you to fall? Can I get you to fall? There's no way, right? There's no way I could get you to fall. There's no way that this would work. I can backstab you from here. Right, he does that attack. That gives us time to go here. Perfect. Alright, let's see if we can do that again. That freaking can almost killed us. Okay, get him to do his Art of War here. And that gives us time to backstab him. Of course, we messed up our backstab, so great job us. Yeah, he's one that we need to be patient with. Especially as we don't have any, any way to heal. We're out of flasks. We need a Sight of Grace ASAP. Come on, do your Art of War, friend. Do your Art of War. Alright, here we go. Oh no, he's he cancelled it. Interesting, didn't know they could cancel the Art of War. Go. Will this do it? Yes, it will. Unfortunately, I think their item is all the way down now if they had one. I actually can't tell if they had one, to be honest. Be wary of down. Thanks! You know, given that we just freaking Darth Mulled that man. Uh, it doesn't look like there's anything else, but I'm betting there's more enemies. Oh my god, this is a freaking tall tower. And no sight of grace in sight. Come on. Try jumping? No, I think not. Uh, sight of grace. There we go. There we go. Okay. Well, Frankie uh, let me know that he is actually ready to be picked up from work. So, with that being said, we actually are going to end our impromptu stream just a wee bit early. 
But that being said, I will be on later again tonight, at the very least. At the at the very earliest. Can I stop doing that by accident? At the very earliest, though. I mean, it could be whenever. Could be whenever. With that being said, guys, as always, if you guys did enjoy the show, please make sure to hit that follow button. If you haven't already, though, check out our Edge Life campaign. We're trying to help heal kids at Sanford Jones Hospital here in Fargo, North Dakota. On that note, guys, I'll see y'all later for some more Elden Ring. Bye-bye!